So good evening, folks. Hello. Welcome. So welcome to Pilates for All. And I see we've got lots of people coming in. Fantastic. I don't want to be out here on my own. So welcome to these classes. These classes are being put on for, uh, from Fusion and Active Life. And um, oh, it looks like we've got a freeze. I don't know why. I can see a freeze on the screen. Any ideas? Hmm. Maybe that's to do with why. We've got a couple of more minutes to fix this, hopefully. Oh, yeah, we're back again. So I don't know if it froze for you, but it definitely froze for us over here. So sorry about that. And it uh, doesn't matter. We've got a couple of minutes to sort that out. So Pilates for all. For those of you who know it, fantastic. It's going to be Pilates for, for everyone. So whether we're a beginner or whether we're experienced, uh, there'll be lots and lots of options. And for some of you that may be looking after injuries and, uh, you know, going through rehab on injuries, please, please, please take the lower options. And even if the lower options are not suitable for you today, then please, um, you can put something in for yourself or you can sit back, have a stretch. And if we're going too fast or you feel I'm going too fast, slow your moves down because we're not going with total um, choreography. We're going to just enjoy our moves, stay in our moves as long as we wish to and come out into stretch when we need to. So please don't feel that, oh goodness, I'm lost now. So don't be lost, just sit back for a moment and then come in when you're ready. Because uh, this is your class, okay? This is your class, so whether you're absolutely a strong fitty or whether you're absolutely just starting out, this is your class and I want you to um, you know, feel comfortable in your zone. Yeah, and we've got a minute to go. We've got lots of people coming. So please, please, please like it. I've got some likes already and I haven't started. They must be my family or my friends. <laughs> it's definitely, definitely not even started yet and we're getting likes. So thank you very much for those. You can drop a comment in the live stream. I Hopefully I'll be able to read it. I'm, I'm sure I will. And um, please, please share. So if you've got a minute to go, you can share on your Facebook or what have you and say, hi, I'm doing this. Come and do it with me. Uh, if you like to. Well, I won't be coming round, obviously. That's, that's not on right now. But come and join me in this live session. So, shall we get, get ready? What do we need? A mat if you've got one. Haven't got a mat, don't worry. A towel will do. The mat is just a softener for when we're laying on our backs. Bare feet. Bare feet's great for Pilates and balance. If you prefer to be in your trainers, I do today. I've got my trainers on. But for Pilates... If you're better off in bare feet, please, please wear your bare feet. Okay, no slippy socks. Good to go. I'm going to press, press play and get moving and get you guys moving. So we're standing by our mats and we know that Pilates is about posture. So let's think about that first. Heels under hips, tums are in, core is braced as they say. Bring up your shoulders. Take a beautiful breath down. Again, lift this time. Exhale. And then take those shoulders. Hi, Helen, I can see you. I've got a fabulous, thank you. Keep going, I intend to. <laughs> I'm back. And round. Good evening, Sorsha. So from here, take a little reach over. And if we can, step behind. Just a gentle reach for now. Let's try the other way. Hi, Tiffany. That's my daughter. Good girl. So just give me a side to side. I just want to warm that waist up a little bit. I know we're going in super gently, but it is seven o'clock. And if you're in your pajamas, Pilates in pajamas, I'm sure it's fine. They say comfortable to tire, don't they? Up and around. So this time, a beautiful lift up. Hi, Clara. Lovely to see you. Big lift. Take an exhale slowly for your first one, just to feel what's going on. And then if we want to quicken up, of course we can. But if we want to stay slow, because that's the best way for us, we can stay slow. Give me a beautiful breath. Take one shoulder back and take the other one. Do a double lift up. Big inhale. Exhale, one shoulder, and the other one. Take that reach across one more time. 
Maybe it'll go a little bit further. We're getting warmer, yeah? Good start. Hi, Renata. Hey, <laughs> Gisby's in the room, other side. Lovely to see you. I've got lots of comments going on. I've got to concentrate, guys. Go back to that big lift off. Exhale, drop through. Now, I know some of you are super bendy, and if that's you, you could take a little back extension here, but that's only suitable for some of us. Some of us need to stay in our neutral, yes? One more time, reach that over. Reach, reach, reach. <laughs> Hi, Tom. Other side, over we go. It's a beautiful lift. I'm going to take this into the legs now. So those of you who like to squat or don't like to squat, a little wider here, down. Push up. So Tom's in and bombs go back and chest stays up. Now when we do this, how deep do we go? Well, how deep can we go? Knee joint is safe. And maybe that's a little bit too deep today. So if it is, partial range is absolutely fine. Down, down. And back up. Hi, Helen. <laughs> so that's Helen. Down, down. She's also on our timetable. Look out for her. She's super. Last one. Breath up. Drop through. Now, we might be going a bit quicker, but we might be staying slower because that's what we prefer right now. So what's good? And remember what I said about that little extension for the bendy people. Hi, Sarah Terry. It's another one of our instructors. Lift up. Exhale. They're all bored, the instructors. You realize that? Couple more. So we just want to keep you moving, folks, through this little mini lockdown. Stay here. One more reach across, a little further. Are you warmer? I am. Back up. And again. Hi, Grace. She said she's loving it. I don't know if she's eating a tea or she's doing Pilates. I'm not really sure. So we're going to squat right here. Drop. Lift. I've gone a little quicker. A little quicker. Yes. Now, if that's not for you, of course you don't. You slow down. It's fine. We're working legs. Why? Really important to have strong legs, especially as we're getting older, or I am. We're all getting older. Down, down. Back up. Nice work. Hi, Emily. Down for two. We got a lot of people here. I hope to hold on to them. Don't start wandering off. Well, I won't know, will I? Hey, stay put. Breath. Now, this time, exhale, arms go back. Take your shoulders back and down. Yeah? So it looks like this from the back. Squeeze between the shoulder joints. Now, if any of you are working from home, and a lot of you probably are, put those shoulders back and down. Because we're not in our ideal places, are we, to be working at home? Balancing our laptops. Yeah? When we're in our beds. No, 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 no. <laughs> So from this stretch, could we look up? Now those of you in bare feet have been chuffed in bare feet because it's easier. Up on your toes, a little balance. Lift your heels off. Oh, my legs are shaking. Oh. Put those heels down, yeah? Nice work. Come to the end of your mat. Tom's in. Take a relax down your body. So it's called Pilates roll down. You'll be familiar with it. Relax your shoulders here. Tom's in. Now push up through your heels like you're restacking each vertebra. Hey, breath in. Take an exhale. Take that beautiful stretch. Look up. Up on those toes, maybe. Yes? Lift. How's that balance? Any good? Heels land, tummy's in, we roll. Relax down your body. Now you stop where you need to stop, yeah? Just where you need to stop. Can we walk that round? A little stretch round the front there. 
back to the middle. A little stretch to the back there. Are you still there? Back in. Can we walk it forward? Now, can we do nice, strong heel down? How are you doing? Are you still there? I hope so. So we've got great stretches going up the legs. Now we can stay here or we could try this. Knee goes opposite elbow, then pushes up and then comes forward and taps down other side. So it goes over, then up and then forward and tap down. If that, do that again, but otherwise we could do it on our knees. Of course we can. So we could take the load out. Does that make sense? Just taking the load out. Yeah? If not, stay where you were, up on your toes. Back up to down dog. Give me the walk in the legs. Pushing the heels down. Let the head drop. Can we walk that back to the toes? Can we relax here? Don't worry if it's relaxing here. We've said all that. Don't worry. This is your range, your class. Roll up. Breath. Exhale. There's your beautiful stretch. You look up, remember? And then up on your toes if you can. You don't have to lift very high. Press your toes down. Land your heels. Chin in. Relax to roll down. This is your roll down. So if you do Pilates, you're familiar with this one. Walk it forward. Give me that down dog. Here it is. So we go knee over, knee over, over. Up. Forward. Tap down, other side. Over. Up. Forward. Tap down to plank. Hold. How are we doing? Now we're struggling. We could always do this, can't we? Yeah? You know that. If the wrists are struggling, we can do this. Absolutely. Otherwise, we're up here looking good, long and strong. Back up to your down dog. Forward. Hold. Pushing back. There's your down dog. Hey, take the back hand to the front ankle. There's a lovely twist there. You might want it. You might not want it. Other side. We're here. Good job. Sit back and have a stretch. So you're right here looking lovely. So here's our shoulder stretches if we're struggling with shoulders at any time. Yeah, at any time. Other way. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Let's think about the leg first. And tuck under. Out. And in. Now let's think about the opposite arm. Out. In. Now if we're struggling, of course, we can go back to leg only. Yes? Out. And the tuck under, that's great for your abs and mobility of spine. However, if backs are a bit stiff and sore, we just come to neutral. Does that make sense? Again, tucking under. Beautiful and long. So we're on the same side. If you've swapped sides, don't worry. Doesn't matter. You can come back. Now, right here, hands under shoulders. Cat stretch first. Tuck. Release. Tuck. Release. Knock on easy triceps. Elbows down. And lift. And down. Now, for some of you, again, no, no, no. Give us the big stuff. So, back. 
lift some of you super strong and down up or down back so take the option that suits you now changing sides out long tuck it under out long and remember what we said about shoulders taking the stretches if you need it and remember what we said about wrists because with plates you are in, in tabletop a while out under beautiful and long and tucking in small whoa not so good this side do you notice your balance is compromised yeah you might do still there come on nearly there so if we can get that tuck under we can get those abs now think about straightening the arm thumb up and driving back with a heel on that leg more glute work yes option here under release whoa what's the other option can you remember it was the tricep work beginners were here stronger guys and girls were here and some of you super people you're on your toes yes so the hands are directly under the shoulders they're not wide I'll let you know when we do the wide ones keep the hands in the inside of the mat and the elbows scrape here listen up can we try this opposite arm out back in and drop and lift out back in drop and lift easier option out back in cat out back in cat whoa have a breather so have a think about that did you notice I didn't come under because I didn't have time I went straight out and back and then I did my move yeah some of you and I know some of you can do this better than me obviously you can out in drop lift out in maybe knees drop lift out in now I know some of you out there can do it and others are saying to me right now you gotta be joking yeah so choose your options we've got plenty of them remember lengthen come back tuck lengthen come back easy press lengthen come back tougher try up here what you could do is just arm only how about that one keep them coming keep them, I trust you're doing them I trust you're not eating your tea <laughs> all right breathe well if you are eating your tea make sure you get it later fair enough <laughs> so beautiful stretches hey how are we feeling four okay good news rest in the shoulders just for a little bit back extension comes up up down now I'm resting the legs there's nothing going on so I'm lifting my chest off yeah up now we can all do this I know you can so some of you want a little more than that okay up down we've got other options we've got fingertips elbows we've even got the straight arm original lift so right now lifting off the chest and lowering the best way for you the best way for you four so the best way for you it might be here three it might be here two super strong people hands here hot hands here up hands wide easy option down so notice the difference yeah because we've gone wide why do so you want to get a little bit more pec work now now 
to make that easier, should you need to, you just come in closer. You know how to make it tougher. You know how to make it tougher. Down, down. Lift. Yeah, you know that. Big push. Still got people saying hello. <laughs> Hi, Dan. Anybody brave enough? Three little bottom ones. Three, two, one. Big push. Three, two. Got brave enough? Try those. Three, two, one. Even easier. Remember the even easier one. Three, two, one. Sit back. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Okay, I want you to think about glutes and hamstrings. I want you to rest your upper body. I know you'd be tempted to do both at the same time, but I want you to focus legs. So we come up, up and down. So really focus now because we're not going to do the arms. I know you can, but I'm going to get better results if I get you to target glutes and hamstrings. Some of you, double legs. Yes or no? Tucking under. Tucking the toes under. Lifting off. So you've got the option. One leg. Or both legs. And another option. And some of you love this one. And you probably will know it. When you come up, out, in and down. With your legs. All right? Don't start waving your arms about. <laughs> up. Out, in, down. Does that make sense? Up, out, in, down. Single leg option, up and down. So feel it. Where are we feeling it? We need to feel it. Glutes and hamstrings, keep them coming. Up, up, down and down. Can you put up with four more? Four more. Lift, lift. Lower, lower, or lift, open, in, and close. Remember the one leg option. Up, up. Almost there. Almost there. You made it? All right. Let's work the back. Tuck it under. Oh, so that was a toughie. Well done. Now, I know we can do arms and legs at the same time and be like that, but sometimes it's nice to strip it back and focus on the what and the why. Yeah? Promise? Start here. Here's your plank. So we start here, beautiful and long. Now we've got the option up on our toes. Now, sinking too low is a different no, 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 no. Up high, it's not effective, but it probably won't hurt you. It's just not effective. So can we stay or can we tap? Do we want to tap opposite arm, opposite leg? And if we do, can we still stay pretty stable? Have a little think about that. That's a maybe or maybe not. How are you getting on? Stay strong. Four more. Four. So with or without the tap out, what's best? Some of us are here on our knees. We might want to tap our arms. And that's absolutely fine. Yes. Or we might want to stay put. Good job. Elbow. Under. Lift. Now, here. Tough one. So maybe here. And listen. These shoulders need to be on top of each other. You don't want to be out there with this hanging down here. Get it up and lift. Good. We can tuck. We can open. We could stay here. We could tuck. Now watch the feet. So they're moving with the hips. Yes? Moving with the hips. You may be saying, no thanks, I'm going to hold it. Four more. Yes? You might be saying, no thanks, I'm staying here. Or you might be moving for me. So what's best for you today? What's best for you today? So we're here. Hey, hey, hey. Now we might need a cat stretch. 
we might need a shoulder stretch. We might need to go straight to plank because we're a fitty. And we might be on plank and going, come on. Here. Remember this? All this? Even this? Possibly this, yeah? Lots to play with Pilates. That's the problem. That's why I keep talking. Sorry. I'm going to whiz round. You know why? Because I've got to do the other side. Lift. Up. So here's your first option. Just hold it. Yeah? Second was put your knee down. Now the third thing could be, I don't want to do that today. And that's fine. You'd stay here where you were, yes? Can we tuck, lift, see the hips go to neutral and then they stack? Does that make sense? How you doing? I'm going to get four more. Three. Can we get two? I know you're struggling. One. Back here. Maybe. Or maybe no thank you. Yeah, or maybe stretch right now. What's best for you? What's best for you? So remember your stretches. Sit back, give yourself a breather. Or hold that plank. Four more. Hold that plank or take a breather. Three more. Hold that plank or take a breather. Two more. Still holding your plank. I know some of you are. Stay here or a little finale. Up, up, down, down. Lift, lift. Now we might want to do this on our knees, but please, please, please. Make sure you alternate the push-up because we've got, uh, obviously, our favorite push-up arms. Up, up, down. Grip those abs. Come on, you're nearly there. Couple more. Make it worth coming in tonight. Last time. Whoa. You're there. Whoa. You said to me, when can we lay down? Right now, all right, right now. <laughs> Phew. So we're here. Pelvis. People talk about the pelvis in Pilates all the time. What does it mean? Hip bones facing the ceiling. Lower back on that mat. Tums in. You can roll into your mat, roll away and then get me central, what we call neutral. All right. Relax those shoulders for a moment. They've had enough. One leg, two. We tap. Toms are working. Yeah? Nice little low impact move on the lower abdominals. Some of you want more. Go further. Some of you want more from that. Go longer. Some of you want your upper abs. Lift it. One. Hey. So what's happening here? Everything. Lower abdominals, definitely. Shoulders off. Upper abdominals. It's all going on. Remember, remember, we started here. And that might be where you want to be. So remember we started here. So remember that. All right. Promise me you will. Stay strong. Four more. Ex Anthony, how does good evening? Little celebrity come in the room. I'm Joe. Seen him at Edinburgh. He's pretty good. <laughs> His co pilot is better. <laughs> Not really, Ex Anthony. I'm joking. Four more. Beautiful, long, and strong. Didn't realize it's going to get celebs in. All right, they're bored, isn't it? They're bored. It's Monday night and there's no shows on, so. They might as well be doing their Pilates. Long legs. So remember those options. You remember them. Shoulders down. Some movement. Make sure you do. 
right here. EGPG, relax, over. Oh, that feels nice. Come back now. Are you leaving your shoulders on the mat? Tell me you are. I believe you. All right, because I can't see you. Maybe, maybe. Try that one. Both shoulders on the mat. Promise me they are. Other way. How you doing? Some of you fitties out there, you're probably already doing it. I know what you're like. There's a tough one to this. Yeah. I might only do this only the once. <laughs> Back. Other side. So how are we doing? Oh. So that's your hip rolls, folks. Start here. Level pelvis. We start again. Promise me. One. Two. If you need to stay here today, please do. Promise me you will. Yeah. A thumbs up will do. Longer legs. Now, when we go longer, you'll notice straight away. Oh, I feel that now. Yeah. Further away from the body. Tougher that's going to be, yeah? Add the shoulders. Two for the price of one. Long legs. Here we go. Hi, Emma. Oh, I've got a friend, Sam, is waving. Yeah, she's ill. She's got the nasty. Beautiful long legs. There they are. Well, yours are, but it's shorter. Strong and long. Keep it coming. So those abdominals are going crazy right now. The lower abdominals are. So are the upper abdominals. Make sure that back, your back will determine what we can do with the legs. Your back will determine that. Remember those hip rolls? Do you remember them? Over. A little tap of both the shoulders down. Back up. So this time, look the opposite way to where the legs go. I don't think we said that last time. I think I was trying to concentrate on you guys. Back up. Some of you toughies. Here we go. Over. Back. Whoa. Beautiful and controlled. So I'm not flopping side to side. Totally controlled. Tiny little tap there. And coming back lovely. Hey. One more time. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Maybe longer. Maybe shoulders. Maybe long. Last little bit of effort. Almost there. Come on. Levels, levels. I don't want to start singing. You see Nicole's abs? She sings Gloria all the way through it. <laughs> I said karaoke, Nicole. Karaoke abs. Hug in. Whoa. So, track's called Levels, and we're doing the 100. You guys, the two Pilates regular know exactly what's involved. Tums in, level pelvis. Hip bones facing up. We talked about this. Abdominals on, lower back on that mat. Yes? One leg 90. You can stay here. You absolutely can. Second level. Both off. Knees, hips. Tums in. Yes or no. Shoulders off. We can stay here. We could extend slightly. We pump arms. So Pilates arms is breathe in two, three, four, five. Breathe out two, three, four, five. Breathe in two, three, four, five. Breathe out two, three, four, five. So why was that? Because you did it 10 times. And that's why this is called 100. Yeah. <laughs> Keep strong. Six more. I've been counting. Yeah, too easy. Some of you, this is the original move was here. So what he would do, Pilates' number one move is the 100. They'd all come in the studio and they'd all end up doing this. Yeah, oh dear, thank goodness. Back here. Let's go side to side. Time to wake up our sides. Over. Too easy for some of you. Pick up with a tap. They're slow, so they're going to get you. And then maybe one, 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 one. 
Remember the first option in case you need it. And remember, you can stop any time. Take a shoulder bridge here, heels to bum. Tummy's in. <coughs> Push right up. Why? Lovely hip flexor stretch, a little bit of glute work, and a beautiful inhale. Exhale, roll down. Remember that move because you can pop that in should you need to. One leg. Maybe two. Maybe shoulders. Maybe lengthen. Maybe longer. <sighs> Breathe. Still here. Nice job. Come on, we can do this. So, thumbs are on. Legs don't need to be there. Remember, they can be here. They can even be here. Of course they can. All right. Four more. I was counting. Three more. Two more. You can do this. I know you can. One more. Don't forget, hit that share button. Get other people involved. Lengthen. Yeah, you don't need to be in pain all on your own, do you? Share the love. Remember this one. So you could share now and tell them you missed it, but you can get it later. Options here. One, 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 one. Whoa. Levels, levels. Feet down. Up. Oh, that feels better. As you push up, feel your glutes squeeze and your hip flexors get a lovely stretch. Lift. Relax here. This is fantastic for you. Roll down. I'll let you do a couple more, yeah? Come on. Up, 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 up. We got one more of those nasty old hundreds and roll back so yeah I'm repeating moves why so that you get it so you get it so you get the benefits from it relax one leg stay or two stay or shoulders remember what we said the longer the levers are away from the body the more you're gonna have to work out so what's this pumping about? The breath is in two, three, four, five. Out two, three, four, five. Come on. Nearly there. Four. Two. Will that do? Yes, it will. Hug in. Whoa. Take that bridge. So now we're going to think about hips. So we're going to do hip rotation. And we don't do that very often. Obviously, dancers do. Martial artists do. And Pilates practitioners do. <laughs> and so do yoga. But it's not a regular thing for us. So out and back. Out and back. With the knee. As if there was a pencil on your knee and you're drawing on the ceiling. Yes? If you want to, of course you could do straight leg, not an option. So beautifully, everything else is relaxed, thank goodness. Yeah, abdominals are relaxed. What's working? What's working? Abductors. Abductors. Not much core because we've only got one. Let's try the other side. Circles. So hip circles. Don't think this is it. All right, this is your warm up. All right. So I'm warming up your hips. So don't you're walking off now. I want you to stay because it's going to get bigger. Remember we said long legs is fine. Take one up. Take two up. Now you've got the option. One only. Other one. Now I did straight legs. You don't have to. Some of you strong ones. Shoulders off. Try it. 
down, down, down. Now, open, back, back. Too much today, not a problem. Take one instead. Take one instead if two is too much. Your back will determine if two or one is too much. Keep them coming. Down, 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 back. Now, you don't have to be doing straight legs. Of course you don't. The rotation will still happen with the legs bent. It will still happen. So please don't worry if straight legs is not happening. Lovely. They're super slow, so you need to get super strong. You might not be today, but we've got two more of these classes, and you will be by the end. Knees together. Remember those hip rolls. Over. Look the other way. Little tap. Oh, that feels good. That's what we need. Yeah. Back. Other side. Remember some of you were doing double legs on that, yeah? We're back. Shoulders down or shoulders off. Shoes. Lower. Back. Double legs or single. Bent legs or straight. Lower. Back. Bent legs or single legs. Remember, down. Back. Remember, shoulders down. Make life easier for yourselves if you need to. It doesn't matter. One more. Nearly there. Hip, oh, <coughs> hip rolls, sorry. Over. We got one more exercise, I promise you. One more track. We got to say good night. Oh no! I oh, know. I'm sorry. Back. So from here, roll to the sides. Push yourselves up. Good luck with this one. So back to abs and a lot of back work here. I've got. Um, be ready. Just sort myself out. Sit lovely and tall. You're sitting nice and tall. You are. Tuck your pelvis slightly under and come back. Now, if you're a bit nervous of this, because you might be, you can hold on and you can just see how that feels. Does that feel okay? Stay there if that's where you want to stay. Those of you that want more, taking yourself further away from your body. Again, some of you are desperate to get to the floor and probably already have. Beautiful inhale here. And then we exhale as we rise. And we rise with control. What we can do, that little stretch, if we wish to. Tucking under the straight legs or bent legs. The original move was straight legs. But when we first start out, bent legs, I think, is a little bit easier. When we get to the top, I want you to twist. Now, if we've got back issues, we might want to sit tall and just work on movement other way so you might just want to work on the movement of the twist that's good but some of you will want more so I need you to tuck under and use more abs try taking a stabilizer off swap sides so with the twist obliques and core to roll up here we go tucking under rolling the spine so imagine each vertebra landing yeah take a beautiful breath here now as you come up feel like you're peeling off like, like velcro literally peeling off whoa super stretch some of you some of you super strong people try it without the arms <coughs> because the arms do assist us a little bit. So try without the arms. Now we've got to, oh my word, this is going to be a little bit harder, yeah? Again, super smooth. Tuck in your pelvis. Ah. Oh. Beautiful breath. My daughter's now moaning about the roll-ups. 
big lift. Thanks, Kevin. Couple more. Tuck it under. Tuck it under. Lovely to hear from Kevin. Back up. Have a lovely stretch. Do you remember that side stuff we just did? The twists. Now, some of us wanted to stay just with the twist. And some of us want to go a bit deeper. And then we said about stabilizers off. Yeah? So try both legs. For some of you, twist. So I want to make sure when I deliver Pilates that we can deliver it for everybody. So my beginner might be just working here. And it doesn't matter. Because working here is better than not working here at all. Yes? And then I've got some of my fitties going, come on, bring it on. And that's good too. One more time each side. Yes, yes. How's those legs? They aching up there. Mine up. <laughs> Change. Change. Yes. Here we go. Roll ups without the arms, Sarah Gower. Tucking under. Oh. So without that big swish up that some of you have been doing. Now you got to think about it. Can I have one more? Can I have one more? Come on. One more. Beautiful breath. Up we come. How smooth is that? How smooth is it? Pretty smooth? All right. Relax. So we've got to go very soon. So we can have our legs wide or we can have our legs crossed. Now, some of you I know can cross your legs beautifully. And what happens is the knees flap onto the mat. And I look at you when you're doing that and I think how wonderful that is. But my knees won't do that ever. <laughs> so, arms out. Twist. Lower. Lift. Centre. Now, I hope you've enjoyed tonight. I hope you've no idea how scared I was. Well, you probably have because I haven't stopped talking. Yeah. Again, big twist round. So big thank you to Fusion for making this possible for us. And a big thank you to Active Life for putting the venue on and supplying you with your instructors. So please keep tuning in. Let's take a stretch over. Yeah? Please keep subscribe. Get involved. We've got something every day apart from Sunday. If you're up early tomorrow, you can wake up early with Sean. Yeah? And good luck with that one. But, you know, I've got you fit for that, so you're going to be fine. <laughs> All right. Bring those legs together. We are saying good night. Bring the legs here. Tuck it right under. And release. Now, remember this one. This is a great one. When you're stuck at your desk, some of you, I know you are. Just jump down and get yourself some stretches. Straight up to that down dog. We've got long legs. I'm going to whiz it side by side. So remember this one? You do? Lovely. Now walk it. So you bring the hands close to the toes or to the knees. It doesn't matter. Please don't remember that this is your class, your range, and your intensity. Up you come. So all I want to do is provide Pilates for all, and I mean all. I want my absolute beginners to feel comfortable in class. And I want my fitties to get a great workout. Remember that stretch I said? This one. The one where we're too long at our desks. Squeeze it. Thank you so much for coming in. I'm going to see you next time, next Monday. Please come in next time. Yeah? Give yourselves a clap. Even if you're in your living room giving yourself a clap, it doesn't matter. Till next time, tomorrow morning we kick off with Sean. Join us. Thank you so much for coming along. Big thank you, Fusions, for doing all this for us. And thank you for Active Life for providing it. Till next time, give us a like, share it, get some other people involved. Yeah? Till next time. Thank you. Bye bye. Hate, then you're bound to get irate.
madness with to demonstrate and that's exactly how hate works and operates man we gotta set it straight take control of your mind just meditate and let your soul just gravitate to the love so the whole world celebrate people killing people dying children hurt and again and crying can you practice what you preaching? Would you turn the other cheek up?